look at those DPS numbers. Now, this is on War Priest on normal. You can see probably bigger than what you've seen from numbers. Now, I'm not doing anything magical. I'm using some buffs and stuff to my advantage, but I'm here to show you how you can do the same. Now, this is a stock standard type with firing line. We're about to throw a divinity on it as well. Or, sorry, a well first, and then we're going to throw on a divinity. Now, the well gives us 25%, and the divinity gives us an additional 30%, also making crit shots a bit easier as well. Uh, but for this example, I'm showing you all the ways that normal teams will do DPS, right? Now, some people will go and throw taking charge and high energy and fire on, and you can stop right there. It's a big, big, big mistake. Now, the reason it's a big mistake is it does not stack with well. Now, this is stock standard with just high energy fire. So you can see the additional damage, which is great. You can see divinity applied to it. You can see the additional damage. Now, this is where it gets interesting, right? So as soon as this is done, you're going to see us throw down a well, as well as divinity and high energy fire. And look, it's the exact same as if I wasn't running high energy fire. So the uptime on it is very, very small. So please stop running high energy fire and taking charge if you're using a well and divinity as they do not stack. Now, what you want to be doing is using elemental time dilation on a stasis piece of equipment. And then you want to run three stacks of font of might, which you can see here, and one elemental ordinance or a way to generate a elemental well. Now, you're going to say seek. The timer on that's terrible. No, that is where elemental time dilation and the three stacks come into play. They stack, they give you a total of 20%. And you can see in this footage right here, I'm about to pick up this elemental well and go straight down for DPS. You get 20 seconds worth of additional damage. And look at those juicy numbers, 128K. So you can see here why this is the way to go. Now you can keep proccing it if your teammates are proccing wells as well, which would work even better if they were doing this for you. Um, and then you can also stack less. This is a video here showing you guys the exact differences in the time. So just the single gives you 10 seconds. Two stacks gives you, I think it's 16. And it's, it's definitely not 15. It looks a little bit more than that. And then the three gives you a 20%, a 20 uh, second timer for that extra damage. Now, the way this works is you need to have a matching weapon to your super so if you're using an arc super use storm chaser if you're using a void super you need to use uh, the type and if you're using a solar super you need to be using cataclysmic if you're using stasis eh, i don't know of a stasis linear fusion ruffle of my head reads regret you need to use read regret so that's how you match them um, and look hopefully this guys can this guy this can help you guys out with some extra damage as i said this is here designed to show you guys how to do more dps i don't always run this I usually just run stock standard, but I wanted to show you guys how you guys can produce as much DPS as possible and make it easier for you, especially with all the conversations around Divinity being nerfed and things like that. Have fun, guys. I hope you appreciate the video. Tag some friends that could use it, and I will see you guys on the next one. Stay groovy. Stay safe. As always, I appreciate you. Deuces.